Okay, Paloma and Noah are coming for sure. <laughs> Wonderful, honey. Wow, looks like we're the first ones here. I hope we're not too early. Oh, no, not at all. Hello, Reeve. Julian. Um, perhaps we could have a word. Um, I need to help Whitney with something. Well, everything's pretty much done, Mom. Uh, I think you're forgetting something, sweetheart. Oh, yeah, I guess we should finish up. Um, you know, I forgot. I've got to go take, uh, take my pills. Oh, yes, yes. So I'll be back in a few moments. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm going to go look for Teresa, too. Okay. I'd like to speak with you in private. About what? What about Fox and your, uh, your ongoing adultery with Miguel? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, don't play the innocent me, young lady. I know you've been seeing Miguel behind my son's back, behind my dying son's back. Look, I've admitted that I, I still love Miguel, but we've never had sex. Oh, yes, you have. Starting on your wedding night. Do you really think you could lie to me, much less keep your illicit relationship a secret? I have eyes and ears everywhere. Well, then you know it's more than sex. Okay, I love Miguel, and I've never stopped, and I always will. My poor son weren't already dying. Hearing you say that would kill him straight away. Well, I'm sorry, Mr. Crane, but that's the truth. He has been enduring grueling medical treatments to prolong his life. And what do you do? You seize every opportunity to get down and dirty with Miguel, the man who tried to kill your husband. What a pillar of virtue you are, wouldn't your father and poor dead mother be so proud of your duplicity? Look, I'm not proud of my situation, okay? But I can't help the way that I feel. And I never meant to hurt Fox. I love him, but it's not the way that I love Miguel. Teresa wanted me to meet her in the living room, but I wonder what she wants. I haven't thought about work since all this trouble with Vincent started. Oh, jeez. Can't let anybody see that. Maybe I, I just, uh, I, I forgot, I forgot it was my birthday. Oh. <laughs> Trust me, lover. This is one birthday you'll never forget.